back to another video about Fnatic Addicts. Uh, today we're going to be playing Holy Potatoes, a weapon shop. This game is really fun. Um, basically, what it is, is a game where you are a potato and your family owns a smith shop. But sadly, your parents die and this guy greets you and say, hey, here's your weapon shop. So, further not, further, without further ado, let's get into it. Hmm, where is that silly spot? I said to meet me here in the morning. He's really not like his grandfather in any way. Going by that letter, he sat back. Dear Mr. Agent, of course I'll come. What good to eat in part of the town? Silly empty-headed fool. Of course, it's all the best for matter me too. Hey, Mr. Agent, is that you? Oh, you're here at last. Sorry, I got lost. All right, I've been waiting for you all morning. Sorry, I need to do a voice. Stand back for my welcome. <clears throat> Hello, you must be the grandson of Matatata, the legendary potato smith. As the latest Matata's only grandson, you have inherited your grandfather's legacy. His blackness swap. See, I told you his grandfather's died. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah, uh, their money starts because, well, um, they're potatoes. So it starts kind of with these to grow, I suppose. That makes sense D don't worry about this uh my name is jackson this is gonna be the fanatical shop yes okay so um here are my three workers basically at the forge weapons and people buy them i sell them i um, I sell weapons, I mean, no, I make weapons first, then I sell them, then I buy materials, I explore, uh, I, like, bribe people to buy my weapons sometimes, basically, it's weird, and fast forward button, so I'm just going to sell about a total of three weapons, cut most of them out for you, and, uh, except for this first weapon. Don't go all starry on me, Jackson. We're not done yet. There are tons of heroes around the world who need weapons. That you've made a weapon, you need to sell them. I feel so happy. I feel so happy. I feel like singing. Let's get down to business. The forge weapons. More of us have been done. So how do we fight for this wicked foe? Battle of Makana. Pay attention. There's no adventuring here. You're a blacksmith. Oh. The heroes will let you know if your weapon was beneficial or not by giving it a grade. Oh, sweet. So. Oh, it goes D, C, B, A, and then S, which is like legendary. It's crazy. Fix that. How much text do I need to read? So here's the map. Um, this is the next region. I have to upgrade every single thing so I can go there. Uh, basically, I need to sell this and select a smith. So, spoiler alert, I already have a... Um, I already have a world that I'm gonna be try to beat with this series and if you want to see more series leave a like and also um, make sure to comment your thoughts on the series and leave me any notes of what kind of videos you want to see from the future well this is the part where you see nothing and I just forged three weapons Okay, so I've crafted um, literally ever three weapons, which is the max amount you could sell. And I'm going to sell this guy to go. And I'll see what type of bacon he brings home. And click. So I could sell it to this because he is a archer. And I don't get why he likes the dirt. I thought he liked the bow, whatever. Um, nobody likes the ball that much, whatever. And, uh, since he is a fighter, he's really gonna like the axe because, well, that's basically what he likes. Because each hero has their own individual likes for a different type of weapon. And, basically, yeah. Brought home a thousand dollars. I got a C? That's my lowest grade I've ever gotten. Whatever. Um, 
<clears throat> well, basically, um, this video is gonna. I don't really know where to go with now because the intro to this game is very slow, but it'll get way more chaotic because you need to slowly but surely keep making weapons, and like there's exotic smiths you can buy, you can um, hire. And each smith has their own unique abilities. You can change their smith class and everything. And, like, in my other more advanced shop that I started before this series, um, I had to pay, like, 20 grand a month for this game. But I made, like, 10 grand every single weapon. And right here, I'm making, like, 500. So... Um, but basically this is the starting world and um, everybody has different levels of stuff I can send them out to do like um, here let me sh let me show you real quick see he's a level one merchant and um, when I send him to get this, you'll see that his progress bar go for, goes up for being a merchant. So it's kind of nice. And also, you don't have to have everybody at your shop to craft because that's why their boosts are. Um, basically, really slow to begin with, but then it gets really fast. And I'm thinking I'm going to start this off with another... Um, Another selling of three weapons and then see if you guys like this game and if you do make sure to leave a like comment say hey do more uh, holy potatoes and weapon shop okay well cue the me selling weapons it looks like it concludes it for selling I mean for um, what do you want to call it forging forging is the word okay um, so basically, um, all these guys have to like Fanatical Shop and subscribe to my channel. And if they don't, well, uh, I'm not going to sell them weapons. No matter what price they say that they'll pay for them. I'm not, I'm not paying them weapons because you want to know why? Because they're not subscribed to me. See, if you want a free axe, disclaimer, you won't get an axe. And you have to subscribe. Whatever. Um, so he wants 950 for the bow because he's an archer told you this before each um hero i suppose has their own like abilities like you see right here you could see that he likes the dagger and the wand i can't really highlight it but you could see under his name so thank you you're subscribed and i'm guessing you are but this guy this guy he's a loser he doesn't have a shirt on because he's not subscribed And, um, anyways, this is basically the outro because there's nothing else for me to do except for maybe grind some more. But I'll do that off camera, of course. Um, because that'd be really boring. Oh, see, I got an S. Because, uh, he paid me over a thousand, which at this level is so much money. And that is a very, very, very good rating. And if all my weapons were S's, I'd be up to like 100k in no time. Well, anyways, thanks guys for watching. This was a little bit short, but uh, if you want to see this again, make sure to like, comment, and basically, uh, see ya, bye.